During MCO, students from villages deep inside Sarawak did not have access to e-learning. So, Cikgu Natsmi took it upon himself to deliver the learning materials to them. It's the first ever homework delivery in Malaysia. So, I just simply print and I collect all these materials. I hop on truck yang membawa makanan. Then we travel. Sampai ke pun that day, I met with another Cikgu and we discussed. It took like the whole day to prepare and to suit. The hardest part is to locate the student. He took out this one big map and we tried to locate all these 13 villages. It's like total pedalaman, total hujung-hujung hutan and stuff like that. In the center of Sukang saja. By the third trip, we were able to make all 111 students. And there's a rumah yang jauh in the start of Bukit. There's a rumah yang di belakang Sawah and all yang we have to meledak sungai. It was so crazy. We never thought we were able to do that before. <laughs> We able to. Uh, I still remember this one time. Um, it's still a direct because the, the the learning materials is so crazy, crazy heavy. And I almost give up. Then I saw my kids lari, lari turun daripada bukit, you know. Pun ada semua sampah. Semua sampah. Everyone, 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 everyone. I give up. I sit there, mengajar them, giving instruction while my kid does magnetic on whatever the worksheet, you know. This is. Our duty. This is my purpose. If you know of an educator who pursues their passion for teaching beyond the classroom like Chick Goodnatsmi, nominate them for the Rice Educator Awards 2022.